Hey everybody, it's Josh. I'm playing some Troll Story Part 2. This uh, story is pretty creepy as frig, man. Or fuck, whatever you want to say. The lantern drains oil. Here we go. Door's locked. What about this, babe? It's open. I don't trust that room. Not going in there. Not going in there. The adrenaline is pumping through my veins right now. Holy crap. I don't want to go in there either. Oh, really, I don't want to go anywhere in this room right now, but... Well, this guy's staring at me constantly, so... What? I don't get it. Is it some mystical human being? No, it's a troll. It's a troll face. Honestly, this game is so creepy. Like, if you haven't played it, you should try it out. At least get the demo or something. It's pretty freaking sketch. Can you pick this up? Everything's so sketchy, man. Ah. Okay, good. I can enter there. Pop up! Okay. What is the... What is that? Ah. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's one of those creepy things. Is it real? Oh, it's just standing there. Ah! Oh, oh. I'm assuming these guys are fake. Oh my god, this is this is so weird. Look at them. Ah! Ah! What are they trying to get? With? Are they trying to get me? Oh my god, they're burning another one of those things. What are they trying- oh! oh, what are they- oh my god, oh my god, what is going on? Keep cool and cool, keep cool, keep cool, keep cool. Okay, I'm keeping cool, that's, that's all I'm doing out I'm keeping cool, I'm keeping cool. Okay, need for speed, hop suit, here we go. Thanks for the story, that was a pretty good ending. Um, completely the story, I didn't know it was going to be that short. I usually go into my custom stories blind. But uh, what do we do now? The end. I'm going to start another custom story right here, right now. Let's do this. Oh no, it's going to be a pop-up, isn't it? Okay, I know it's the end, I know it's the end. Okay, there we go. Okay, custom story. What should I do, boys? Let's try... The Agony... Never mind. Um, let's try Emma's story. You are Emma, daughter of an esteemed scientist, Dr. Robert Coleman. Ever since his discovery, discovery of the mythical orb of power, he has vanished, leaving you alone in the family estate. With strange things happening, I wonder if what has happened to him. The story begins as you wake up in your room to find an ominous note from your lover. As you play, you will unravel Emma's story. Start. Here we go, boys. So I didn't know Troll Story was only that going to be that left that short. Sorry I didn't go through the other doors. I just wanted to get it done and over with because it's actually kind of sketchy. So here we go. Emma's Story, boys. Um, got that. And I've seen creepy pop-ups in one of those things. I hate story. I hate uh, custom stories freaking pop-ups or like random things. Like I've seen pop-ups in that thing. What is this? Dearest Emma, I don't know how this note will ever find you, but I am in trouble. I am currently in captivity, placed here, I dare to say it, by your father. He has always been a bit off, but this time, he most certainly has gone insane. i never seen him like this before. I believe it is to be related to that object or power he Okay, yeah, you guys can read the rest of this. Uh, actually, I'll read this. Please be careful, but make haste. Remember, find the lab and destroy that orb. Your lover, Neil. My lover is not Neil, I can tell you that right now. I can tell you that right now. Is that guy? 
Get his name. It's not Stefano, because Stefano's golden and that's Peepad's thing, so. Won't copy it. Okay, is there anything we need in here? Like oil? I see you, oil. Give me the lantern. Where may you hide, lantern? Yeah, I'm gonna play all my custom stories blind unless they get really impossible. So, yeah. Oi! You little tinderbox. Give me the... Nope. Well, I guess there's no lanterns in here. Piano. My name is Piano Man. Oh, got a little bit of itch in my arm. Got an itch in my arm. Okay, I know how to use the hint. How do you get rid of that? Okay, there we go. I only had a lantern, for Christ's sake, so... Can you find a lantern before one can be turned on? No! I thought you I thought you just pull one out of your ass and just use it, but holy crap it oh well probably won't be able to use that door so that thing can go screw itself. And what are these? Apparel armor whatever. Are they like Islamic? Or are they to me they look like they might be desert or something like that. No need to be racist or judgmental, but whatever, they look like that to me. Beware, when staying in darkness, stand your slowly drain, turn on oh yeah, we know. This looks really sketch right now, I'm sorry. I'm gonna take everything with precaution. Now this is the real Stefano since it's golden. Cool. 15th May, 1823. This letter is to congratulate Dr. Robert Coleman on his invitation at Landenam. Your invitation, yeah we know. Neil Neville. Give me this. Picked up Landenam now. The original. Hey! What is this? Pointlessness. Not going in there yet. Lock is broken. Maybe if, uh, I don't know here, boys. Hello? Who's in here? Who's the one sleeping in the bed? Is it me? Is it you? It's this tinderbox. So we're stocking up on tinderboxes currently. Uh, it's the weekend, thank god. Pretty random subjects, but I do live commentaries and random- Hey, is that the Bible? Wait a second. What is this? Biblia. 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 Where have I heard that before? Biblia. I think that's the Bible. I don't know. Well, there goes that feather and quill. Oh no, those are the same thing. Never mind. Move to the left, yes, we know how to do this, pretty sure, for- Hey! Hey! 20th of April, you can- I have stashed next to supply of tinderbox and a lantern in the storage closet, adjacent to this room in case of emergencies. If it is locked, which should be used the key to gain entry. Okay, boys, give me the key. We're just- Hey, I thought I saw a shadow or something in here. What does that bird sound? We're just stomping through a mud hole through this custom story right here. No, that's not locked. It's this mofo that's locked. It's this guy. It's this guy. Yes, I do. I do. Why does it always have to be dark? This is freaking... The lantern of life. I don't want to go in there, man. <laughs> okay, good. Nothing, nothing bad happened in here, boys. That's what I kind of do to take away the scariness of the game. Like when I charge in there, I go like, I'll try and do something or something that makes me a little bit cool and cooled off. Oh, three tinder boxes. That's an emergency stash right there. There we go, now we got some light, boys. Nothing like some Sunny Bale trailer park being lit up. Nothing but a carpet in this leg. In this room, or whatever. What is this? Fresh bread? More like corn bread. Well, now we can probably go in that uh, dark room. Wherever it was. Hey, a cross. Here we go, boys. Charge in here. 
Okay, there we go. We're safe. We're safe, boys. No. It's gonna be a pop up here. I know it. I know it. I know it. Because me and my buddy Zach played this before. Is that a note? Is there in there. What is the point of this room then? I don't see a point to this at all. So I'm. Hey! Oh, jeez! I knew there was gonna be a friggin' pop up or something like that. I knew it! I friggin' knew it! Is he coming to this door? Excuse me. You repo man. Just. Bo Russia? Bro. Bo Russia? Bo Russia? Where does this take place? Bo Russia. Merdy old down I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce this. Here we go. I know someone's out there. And I'm not Ooh. There's stuff wasting the lantern here, boys. Box broken. Okay. Thought so. If the lock's broken, the key ain't gonna work neither. So here we go. We're in Emma's story once again. I'm... This hallway. Who would want to live in a house like this? Where it's all dark and there's long as frig hallways. What is this? And on the next episode, we will go through that door and see what lies beneath. Goodbye, everybody.